Hey guys, Tesla's new battery is the beginning of the end for gasoline cars, as they recently held a battery day event showing major breakthroughs that will change the future of electric cars. On battery day, they announced they had many goals, one of which is to cut production costs. By doing this, they would need to make fewer parts for the vehicles, in which they did through manufacturing, and they build all their vehicles from the ground up. The battery was made with five times the reduction in electrical path. This allowed for 16% increase in range, also five times the energy, and six times the amount of power, which is pretty incredible, as we all know the Teslas have a great amount of power already, plus greatly decreased charging time. Well, it would appear that Tesla actually made all of his goals. He wanted to cut the cost of battery production by over 50%, and he actually made it to 56%. I know what you're probably thinking. This is just a prototype, but actually it's not. They've already put this into production, and they have this at their pilot plant in California. Guys, this is so incredible. I'm actually glad to see these major improvements in our technology, and I'm curious to see just how far this is really going to go. I'm really happy that they're being able to make these vehicles affordable for everyone because we all know how much the Teslas cost and it seemed like people with plenty of money are the only ones that have them. So, hey, what do you guys think about this? Are you for the new electric vehicles? I know I'll be sad to see the combustion engine go, but I know at some point we're going to have to let it go. I'd say we'll all be good for our generation Everything's great, but I would say, just like the Governor Gavin Newsom did for the 2035 banning gasoline engines, as you can see, all the necessary steps are moving. So the government stepping in to try to make changes. Also, we have the car companies. They're actually making a lot of advancements in technology, whether it'll be through hydrogen or something else. It seems like we're almost there. As always, guys, I appreciate your kindness, sharing your comments and knowledge and experience. Thank you for watching Nate's Interactive Auto.